Okay, so what's going on with the 601As and the writ of mandamuses and suing them? We have filed 601As in various district courts around the United States, and we have been receiving so much pushback because there is a class action lawsuit going on with the 601A waivers. What are they? If you entered the United States illegally or on a crew visa, you are not allowed to adjust or get your residency in the United States for the most part. There are certain exceptions if you're 245I protected or you know you have VAWA or something like that. But for family-based petitions, again, you enter the United States illegally or you came in on a crew visa, you can't get your green card in the United States through marriage to a United States citizen. So you have to file the 601A, which is the forgiveness, the perdon, the waiver, um, asking the United States government to forgive you for that immigration violation. And then you have to prove to the government that your relative is going to suffer extreme hardship without you in the US and with that person that spouse moving with you to your country, they would suffer extreme hardship if they did that. It is taking four years to get a decision on that waiver right now. Four years. So it's been really out of control, the processing times. There have been a lot of lawsuits filed to push the government to make a decision. And the government is saying, wait, we don't have enough workers. There are thousands of waivers that are in line and we're doing the best that we can with what the officers that we have. It's not personal, you're just gonna have to keep waiting. So that is where we are all at with the 601As.